Aloha, it's Kim Jolene with Finding Your Fiji, and I'm here doing your daily angel insight for Tuesday. And this is the deck that we're going to be using today is Messages from Your Angels. So this is one of my favorite decks, and I affectionately call them my goofy angels, because they're different angels that you may not have heard of before. So um, the card that we've got for you today is Angel Isaiah. I'll hold it right here so you can see it. So Angel Isaiah, Isaiah, and you can see there's a woman that's pregnant in the picture. And so this card is really about giving birth. And it can, of course, be a physical birth where you're actually giving birth to a child. Um, but um, oftentimes it's giving birth to something else, right? Giving birth to a new idea, giving birth to um, a new relationship, a um, new career. It may be giving birth to... Um, you know, almost to yourself again. So I feel like a lot of people are going through a rebirth and that is kind of, it's kind of a reinvention of yourself. And I, I feel this often and particularly recently with the moon energies. So this full moon that we just had um, last week really uh, had an effect on me and I'm still feeling the effect even like, you know, today's Sunday, I'm still, still feeling that I'm shooting this. Um, it, I'm still feeling the effects several days later, right? And so it, it's that energy of like feeling like things are shifting and changing within me as well and getting comfortable with that, getting comfortable with the new me. So it's really a good time um, today in particular to work on those new ideas, right? Um, to shift situations in your life. And Angel Isaiah is there watching and guiding you and helping you with that. So you've got help. You never ever have to do it alone. There's never any anything that you have to do alone. You always have a, a whole team of spirit angels and guides that are there to help you, okay? And they are giving you guidance on a daily basis. Uh, again, if you haven't checked out my... Um, Angel, it's not Angel, it's actually Intuitive Tuesdays. I've been doing a series with Dr. Kara Gubbins, and so we have a new video that's out, um, will be out today uh, on YouTube, and that's on my YouTube channel, Kim Jolene. Just search YouTube, Kim Jolene. I have like, I think, four, over 400 videos now on there. And so this Intuitive Tuesday series, though, really gives you a lot of great information about how to connect with your spiritual team, how to um, get messages, like how they communicate with you, all kinds of juicy goodness. And so I can't recall off the top of my head which video is coming out um, today, but just um, check it out. Go and check out that video as well because, and there's a whole series, I've got a link, uh, I'll put a link to the series below in the um, message portion portion of this on Facebook as well as on YouTube. And so you can check out, I have a web page that has them all listed and then you can actually, it's a direct link to the videos instead of having to search uh, for them. Although I do have a, a line that's Intuitive Tuesdays on YouTube. So it is pretty easy to find on my, on my YouTube as well. But the big message for you guys is this is a time to push, right? Like this is a time to push things forward. It's not a time to hold back. It's not a time to um, stop. It's a time to push forward. It's a time to really give birth to those ideas, those dreams, um, that, that really juicy reality that you want. And again, it's like, okay, let's find our Fiji, right? Let's, let's push forward and um, find our Fiji. And pushing forward doesn't mean you're forcing things to happen. I just want to be clear about that. You're not forcing things, right? You are following the flow because yesterday's card was the shapeshifter. And that was all about, you know, following the flow, allowing yourself to be malleable, right? And so it's not about, you know, making things happen, but it is about taking action, okay? And it's about taking that divinely guided action, that action that is, um, that you are, um, 
you know, you're getting the intuition, you're getting the guidance that's coming through, and it's about taking action on that and moving forward. So um, don't keep your, you know, don't keep this to yourself. It's time to bring it out into the world, right, to really birth it, okay? And then your affirmation today is environmental. It's related to your environment, and the affirmation is this. Um, gosh, you've been, you guys have been getting this a lot. Uh, every room in my home makes me smile. So obviously there's still some rooms in your home that don't make you smile. Smile, right or maybe there's some things in um, some of your spaces that you're just like oh yeah I need to take care of that one of the things that I love to recommend to my clients to do around that is to create a tolerations list so literally you get a um, piece of paper and go around your house and write down everything that you're tolerating this can be like, I need to return this to the store. Oh, I'm, I am, you know, missing this ingredient for this recipe that I want to make. Uh, I have to clean up the, this clutter spot. Um, I need to return these forms. I need to set up a, a regular doctor's appointment or a dentist appointment. There's all kinds of different things that, you know, we keep meaning to do that we're tolerating. But if you can get them out of your head and get them on a list, and then every week, just pick a couple things. And it doesn't even matter it doesn't matter at all what order you do them in just pick a couple things and you'd be surprised how quickly you'll get through that list I think when I first made a tolerations list back when I lived in Minnesota I had like a hundred things on there right and so it just you know it's just a matter of taking care of those things and it feels really good when you do that and that will help you um, so that every room in your home makes you smile right so that's what I've got for you today if you love this if you enjoy my readings or finding value please um, in, I invite you to come and do a private reading with me they are amazing um, and I'm not I'm not saying that, you know, I'm saying that because it's it's a channel thing. It's not me, right? Like I'm just relaying the information and it's amazing the information that comes through and the ahas and it's also um, energetic work that's happening as you're getting the reading. So it's more than just um, just information like there's a there's a physical change that happens a lot of times with people as well and it just kind of helps clear out the cobwebs it helps you really get clarity on what you're meant to do and sometimes really opens you up to seeing um, more things about yourself that you did not you weren't aware of or you didn't understand right and it's just that beautiful um, beautiful connection to your spiritual team and that opens the door as well so it allows you to then connect more deeply with them um, outside of readings as well because you you're kind of opening that channel as it were if you haven't had a reading with me you can use coupon code angel angel 20 to save 20% on any length of reading I do readings from anywhere from 15 minutes to two hours our readings and all my scheduling is online so it's really easy to go in and schedule look at my schedule and see when it works for you and um, and schedule it in and I would love love and look forward to working with you for now relax have fun and enjoy your Tuesday much love